Welcome to my tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you that how can we create a simple football in 3D Studio Max. Uh, first of all, sorry for my bad English, but I will try my best to explain everything that you need to follow me in this tutorial. So, let's start. Let me reset it. I don't wanna save it. Do you really want to reset? Yes, I do. Okay, now go to extended primitives. Choose heat draw and create in perspective view. Wait a minute, I don't like this color. Yeah, this one is better. Now I'm gonna press Alt W to maximize the perspective view. And at this time, I want to see the edges of the object. So, I click on perspective and choose edge faces. Yeah, that's better. Now, let me be quick. Go to the modify tab under the parameters. Click on dodec. The only parameters about 0.38. Radius 30. Okay, now I need to convert this object into editable poly. So let me do this by right clicking on the object, convert to convert to editable poly. Now choose edge and select all the edges of the object. Or just press Ctrl A. Scroll down, and you'll see Extrude. Click on the little box here, and now enter the exact values: height negative one, width zero point three. Now scroll it and choose Polygon. Select all the polygons. I'm gonna press Ctrl A. Okay, now scroll it down, and you'll see tessellate option here. Click on the little box here, and it has been applied. But we need to apply this one more time. So click Apply and OK. Now click on this yellow color here to go to the top level. Okay, now apply Spherify modifier. Here it is. Uh, about 85%. That's looking better. And the last thing that we need to apply is a mesh smooth modifier with two iterations. Okay, now we have a nice football. Hope you enjoyed that tutorial.